Hello, my dear children. How are you all? Hope you all are fine. Today, we will continue the chapter, chapter 3, Animals Increasing in Number. Before we move to the next topic, let's see what we learned in the last class. In the last class, we were discussing about the animals that reproduce by laying eggs. And we checked the life cycle of cockroach. Then we checked how the fish, lizards, turtles, they lay eggs and have children. In this class, we are going to discuss about the parental care of the young ones of animals. When you were small, your parents looked after you very well, right? Like that, all the animals, they will look after their child very well. Most animals take care of their young ones until the young ones are old enough to take care of themselves. You must have seen birds feeding their chicks. Mammals feed milk to their young ones. They protect and keep, take care of their young ones. Now we will check the exercise of this chapter. We will start with the set A. You have to take the correct option. The first question, living things are able to produce more of their own kinds by the process of? The answer is B, reproduction. Coming to the second question, the process of shedding the old skin is known as? The answer is B, molting. Coming to the third question, a caterpillar is the larva of? The answer is C, butterfly. Coming to fourth question, the young one of a cockroach is called, the answer is A, nymph. Girls, that's all about today's topic. So this is time for homework. Today's homework is you have to write the science word file of this chapter in your cup. Thank you. Have a nice day.